Brother Jude. Brother Shamakara. Hello, hi. Yes, 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 sir. Mm. So... Hello? Stop. Ah, yeah. Okay. You know. okay. Um, Sister Yasuko will share your slides uh, because I need to prepare for my session. <laughs> uh, Okay. Yeah. Are we ready? Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm ready. Okay. We have to know enough participants, I think. Uh, uh, there are 34 participants, yeah. Okay, so people are coming in. Shall we start? Okay. Yes. Okay, so good afternoon, good morning, and good evening, everyone. So we have completed the first lecture just now by Brother Kawaja on list right on the green, green world. So there are already a few questions that were asking about uh, cycling at the age of 80, how much that you are going to do and everything. So I think this session will be beneficial. So let's pass the time to Brother Shamakara, our Deputy Organizing Chair, uh, Commissioner for this uh, World Scout, Pascal Jambori. So, brother, uh, brother Shama, over to you. Okay. Uh, greetings from uh, India on behalf of World Scouts YS24 Plus. We are going to project our uh, program. Now, my first session is <clears throat> a Global Bicycle Jamboree, which will start from 8, 9, and 10. We are going to speak about cycling for the senior people. So we go to the next slide, please. Yeah, this is our Jamburi logo. Uh, we requested uh, to everybody to prepare this logo and uh, project in their scarf and their t-shirts. Next. Yeah. Uh, this is a uh, the posters that we have already publicized previously. And now we are going to start our <coughs> session. Yeah. Now we are going to start our session. We go for the next slide, please. Uh, this is myself, Shamol Karok, director Senior Scouters Club of 24 World Scout 24 Plus. So I'm from India. I'm going to speak about cycling for the senior people or senior citizens. Uh, next. Uh, this is organized by World Scout Voice 24 Plus, which is the largest scout media in the world. Yeah, next. Uh, this is the bicycle riding for senior people. 
by myself shamul karak director of the senior scouters club next and now <clears throat> for the senior scouters for the senior people uh, what we have to do uh, we have to select the cycle selecting a bicycle for seniors select according to the height weight and physical needs of the senior people maybe 20 20 inches or 22 inches you feel whichever you feel comfortable you take that cycle and try to ride yourself your feet should touch the ground while seated you take you select a cycle which will be fitted to your size by sitting at the seat you can touch your feet so that boarding and unboarding will be very much easy for you which is able to mount and dismount easily now the handle bars handle bars should be high enough to be comfortable for crossing along so your handle bars should be very much comfortable so that you can uh, turn round or you can go farther next is contour saddle the seat of the cycle should be very much comfortable which may be contoured and it may be padded with shape for male and female riders to make longer rides more comfortable because on a cycle you have to ride if you want to ride a long distance your seat should be very much comfortable so that you feel cozy when you cycle yourself now seat adjustment seat adjustment allows a more upright position is a spacious on the back the seat should be very much adjustable which can be acha uh, next one shock observer no actually you are you are going very fast the next slide please mr jude ah previous one cycling for the i mean yeah previous one previous one yeah previous one yeah this one this one yeah yeah this one no second one yeah yes the shock absorbers the shock absorbers in the cycle you have to choose road field that is prepared that is preferred but still buffers bumps on the roads are available so you have to select your cycle where shock absorbers are very good so that in the bumps or in the upgrade gradients you can ride your cycle very comfortably then selecting of tires tires will be wider tires often a more cushion ride choose tires with anti slip grooves for wet weather because your tire should be very much grip to the soil so that you do not slip even it is rainy uh next is terrain uh yeah yeah this one keep it keep it terrain if you go in a hilly area get a bike that's lighter but with good handling ability to inclines that means if you want to climb up and down your handle your seat and your cycle should be very much lighter so that you can carry that cycle and come down now with a brake choose hand brake that firmly grips on both the tires stops under your control so your brake should be very much i mean in functioning so that whenever you want to stop in case of emergency or in case of anywhere so your brake should be on your control so that both the tires can have a grip on the brake next choose e bike if you are very much uh, if you are very much uh, want to comfortable ride so you can take e bike which need not paddle next is in in uk study of 260000 people those that cycle reduce their risk of death from all causes by 40% and remove the risk of cancer and heart diseases by 45% so if you ride a cycle you can reduce your heart disease and if you re reduce your 
uh, cancer. So the study says that cycling is best for senior people and best for your health. Next, cycling can increase your lifespan by reducing the risk of chronic disease. So if you cycle, your muscle works and you can reduce your chronic diseases by riding cycle. Next is cycling certainly boosts physical health and overall well-being. And it can also improve mental health and slow aging process too. Helps in reducing Alzheimer and dementia. So if you ride your cycle, uh, you can have your heart muscles and which can help you stopping, I mean, help you in not growing your age and dementia. Next is according to WHO, World Health Organization, people ages 65 plus should aim for at least 150 minutes a week or moderate intensity aerobic physical activity that is 20 minutes a day. If you want to cycle, you have to cycle 20 minutes a day. Next for seniors who are new to cycling, starting with three times a week or for 20 to 30 minutes each time. So each time when you ride, you have to ride at least for 20 minutes or to 30 minutes so that your body function is properly. Next. Yes, cycling gets you out in the fresh air when it is sunny outdoors. So you will receive a healthy dose of vitamin D. So your sunshine gets your body vitamin D, which is very much essential for your bone health and maintaining a positive mood. Next is cycling is a physical activity. It's a good way to lower stress and cycling low impact movements are forgiving on joints. So you have a lot of joint functions. Uh, by cycling, you can improve your joint functions. Cycling is also beneficial for physical coordination as it exercises the quadriceps and other muscle groups that maintains a balance. Sometimes as we grow old, our balance in the knee becomes very poor. So by cycling, your body muscles and the joints functions very well and so that you can have a proper balance on your body. So your feet and your toes are helps you to keep yourselves proper balance on the ground. Next is consult your physician if you feel weak or nervous before riding. So before riding, you must consult your physician so that you are fit for riding, so that if he advises you, you can go for your riding. Uh, next. Yeah. Regular cycling will quickly improve cardiovascular health and assist in weight loss and weight management. So if you cycle regularly, it will help you in your cardiovascular health process and you can control your weight and you can have the you can have your weight management also it prevents the loss of muscle mass and strengthens strength that's common with the age so as long as we grow your muscles comes down muscles becomes very weak so by cycling you exercise and you do aerobics, so your muscles becomes very strong. Cycling improves positive effect on the immune system, which keeps it working as well as that of younger person. So by cycling, your immune system becomes very strong and so that you become like a young person. Cycling offers a social component that supports mental health and combats depression. When you become old, your friends and your office colleagues are separated because you don't go to office, you don't go to your workplace. So you feel alone sitting at home. By cycling, you can meet people and you can have a social gathering so that uh, you, you can, uh, I mean, combat your depression. Next is, it is a great shared activity to do with family, 
friends or in a club or group that encourages bicycling for seniors so you can join a group or you can join a club or you can make your friends or relatives to go on cycling once in a week so that you can enjoy with them and have a i mean social gathering next yeah cycling increases the knee muscles without traumatizing the joints so when you ride cycle your knee muscles works so it will help you in uh, without traumatizing the joints your joint will not get blocked so there is a tendency of getting blocked of your joints so by cycling you can release of your joints next is cycling assists blood flow pressuring in the center of your brain which helps in memorizing things because as you grow old you try to forget everything so gradually you go to the alzheimer state so by cycling your blood circulation takes place in the brain and it circulates to your body so that your memorizing system will develop next is cycling helps in the immune system to fight against germs prevents bacteria from lungs which controls infection so if you cycle your blood pressure and your blood circulation takes properly in your body so that you prevent from bacteria and your lung work and you control infections getting entered in your body next is at old age loss of sleep increase worries are common cycling can help you to overcome such worries so you can relieve of your tensions by cycling lastly cycling can give you fun and enjoyment to breathe in fresh air see new places and meet new people by cycling you can go new places and you can have your enjoyment with cycling and you can breathe fresh air and you can meet many people on your way so next uh there are some safety tips for cycling put your health hmm. excuse me put your helmet on even if you are just going out when you are just going out put your helmet on so that even if you fall your head injury not doesn't take place so it it can save you from injury next is wear close shoes <coughs> wear close toe shoes to protect your feet and grip the pedal so you have to put your shoes in such a way so that it doesn't slip from your feet and when you pedal you pedal with your toe so your shoes should be very much comfortable so that you can paddle clearly next is in, ensure you have the wearing bell to warn the pedestrians ahead so you, you you should use your bell so that whenever any pedestrians come across you can just warn him with the bell next is attach bike lights to the front and back of your bike for greater visibility so you should have front light and back light at your cycle so that everybody can see you even in the dark so that you will be relieved of getting jammed or somewhere next is add a patch add a patch kit and pump to your bike and know how to use them you have to take certain kits so that if your cycle i mean uh, air goes down you can pump or even if there is a puncture you can try to mend that puncture so you have to keep certain kits with you before you travel uh, next next slide please yeah wear reflexive or light colored clothing so that motorists can see you easily at night 
so you have to put certain clothes so that motorists can see you at night even at night you will be visible so your clothing should be very much reflective so that everybody can see you at night next is avoid cycling at night if your night vision is very poor so don't try to ride cycle at night if your vision is very low next is signal well ahead of when you intend to turn and check for traffic so you must know the hand signals so you have to put your hand signals and turn and check while on traffic so next is carry a mobile phone and a battery charger in case of emergency you have to carry a mobile phone and a battery charger in case of emergency because if you want to call in time of your danger or in time of your problem so you have to use your mobile phone so you have to carry that with your self during your journey next is always have some form of id on your person always carry some identity card while riding so that if you are in trouble that identity card can be uh, shown to others so that they can identify you and reach you in a safe place next is take your timing to make sure that you are ready for the road so take your timing don't go very fast don't go very slow you try to take your space according to your rhythm according to your health next please yeah check your routine before you head out to check your route you have to check your uh, travel route before you go out so where you are going next is keep in mind that your reflexes are slower now that you are elder you have to always think that you are elder person and your reflexes are getting slower so that when you ride don't think that you are a young person or you have to overcome someone so go according to your own space don't go very fast next is make sure that your proper equipment your proper equipment means make sure that your cycle is uh, totally fit your brake and your tires and your handle seat everything is equipped next is don't try to keep it up if you can't if you can't ride don't try to keep it up better you drop that riding next is have a practice run on your bike before it takes out for the first time if you are going to ride for the first time you have to have a practice run so that you don't fall down or you don't find any trouble in riding the cycle so you practice very well then only you ride on the road next is choose your course wisely that means choose your direction choose your route very wisely so that you can come back very comfortably with your cycle next please yeah <clears throat> never cycle with ear phone on don't try to ride a cycle with your ear phone so that you cannot hear the horn or you can hear the signal which is given from your back or in your front so that you must be very much alert don't try to carry ear phone while riding learn the proper hand signals for cyclist for cyclist you must try to have your hand signals you know how to use your hand signals so that traffic police and other people can see your hand signal and give you space next is if you have to stop get far off the road so if you have to stop somewhere uh, get in a safe side far off the road so that you are not i mean uh, overtaken or you are not bang with somebody next is if you can ride with your another person will be better if you can ride with another person since you are a senior person if you ride with your company if you ride with your partner it will be very better so that in case of your difficulty he can come to your help next is fuel your body before riding before riding you must take some food don't go in a empty stomach don't go with soft drinks or something like that take something while you ride so that 
you don't feel tired after going certain places. So next is take rest seriously. When you go for a cycle for certain distance, sometimes you have to take rest. Don't exhaust yourself too much so that you'll be very much tired and you won't be able to return back. So take rest compulsory. Seriously, you have to take rest. So this is all for today's lecture. Uh, next is, yeah. So with this, we end today's session. So now we go for question and session. If there is any questions, uh, I'm here to satisfy you with the answer. Thank you, Brother Shamal. So very informative. Uh, oh, we have one already. So this is Poco M4 Pro. Maybe can we type your name? Amit also, please, thank you. Poco, you can unmute yourself. You raise up your hand. Do you have a question, please? I think uh, with this, I think everybody enjoyed this program and uh, they have uh, learned something, particularly the senior people to ride cycle and how to take precautions and what are the measures they have to take. So these are all bullet points and you can keep this documentation to you. So it will be very much helpful for riding cycle. Anyone with question? Uh, yes, sir. I have a question. Yes, please. Hello. Yeah. Hi. Yeah. Uh, is there is there like any bicycle signals other than like left and right, or is that the only signals that they have? There is no specific uh, bicycle signals. Only in your right hand side or left hand side you turn. You just show your left hand or you show right hand. So this is the only thing that we use in our riding bicycle. And uh, yes. while riding bicycle, uh, you, you must for the details also because there are zebra crossing, there are certain uh, lights there. So you must know traffic signals before you go for a cycling so that you have to observe the road safety also. Yes. This young man is very uh, intelligent, very intelligent person. Let's clap for this. You know, let's appreciate the young people to participate. You know, yes, yes, yes. Uh, this is a courage. They are talking to 60 plus years old veterans and then asking them. That shows that we are connecting. Thank you. Yes, we really are, we are together. Yeah. yeah. Brother yeah. Patao, yeah. 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 I want to say, is there any specific bicycle for senior citizen? <laughs> uh, there is no. Uh, uh, yeah, Mr. Kajwa can say this. Uh, <laughs> so there is no specific bicycle, uh, okay. particularly for the seniors. So for the seniors, we prefer the light bicycle. 20 okay. inches will Thank be you. preferred, Thank and it should be very, very light. So that you can just carry if in case of your uh, problem. Don't take okay. any heavy Thank you. bicycle. Thank you, sir. So manage. Thank you, sir. Good job, Dan. Mr. Santosh. Yes, you are here. Come, come. Uh, your question continue from first lecture. <laughs> Yeah. Her question I'm was very interesting. Very complex. I'm sir, Mr. Kalta. Please, the meeting over. <laughs> yeah. Sir, I want to ask one question. Uh, as we are older adult people, so we have body ache or some physical problem, means ki, um, multiple problems, like old and like and old age problems, and diabetes and hypertension. Glamisic and sclerosis problem in 
body and some have a, a paralysis problem also nervous system so they are, is they are capable to capable to ride bicycle or not In yeah before and... uh, riding bicycle for the for, no actually if you are a regular rider no, no. so it will be easy for you to control if you are a, if you are a first time rider you must consult physician so that you can ask doctor you are having such problem whether cycling will suit you or not so you must uh, ask your doctor if your doctor says okay you can ride for a uh, not for a long distance for a for a while or 10 minutes 10 minutes or 15 minutes you can do that so you have to consult your doctor about your problem it may increase the pain i think not good for them yes, yes. who but, has a problem thik yeah yeah spinal problem or back yes, yes. problem but for it may increase them hmm. or particularly yes. weak long long ride is not a solution for them but <coughs> help long ride the doctor who have common uh, problem uh, not go for a long drive go for a small drive so you can have a practice and your muscle system and your body movements will help you in getting cure so you have to consult her for that but the kawaja can go 120 kilometers <laughs> next time next now time a born cyclist kawaja is a born cyclist and at this age also he rides because he is very on this this is passion and longer distance to cycle but we can take our time uh, we don't have to go so far we know what our body is capable so judge yeah. accordingly you know all the risk so please be safe on the road also uh. ah okay next question you have rono rono please amy also rono Brother Rono, hi, are you there? You raise your hand. Brother Pokpo, you raise your hand. Are you trying to say something? Please unmute yourself. Anyone with questions? Please ask away. what should be the shape of the tires in 30 my brother akta um there are so many tires for cycling there are narrow thin cycle uh, tires uh, when do, those tires whose width width is uh, much more Brother, you can Not use sure Hindi that. or uh, Tamil to speak. No problem. कुछ टायर रहे जो हम दे हैवी टायर हम दे कुछ ब्रीक टायर हम दे पाइप ब्रेड साइकिलों के पास टायर है वो किस तरह से चाहिए दिया कई तरह से साइकिल आगे भी आ मार्गी दी टायर हम दी चढ़ाई ये दी या ज़्यादा हम दी कहीं आते आप तो ये आपका साइकिल आपका आपका आंसर हम दे हिंदी में आपका साइकिल थोड़ा हल्क लाइट वेट ना है जिससे कि आप ऊपर ऊपर नीचे करेंगे तो हल साइकिल अच्छा रहेगा हाँ तो यू कैन प्लीज सदन में थोड़ा प्रैक्टिस कीजिएगा तो धीरे धीरे आपका कंट्रोल में आ जाएगा बॉडी बैलेंस एंड अदर थिंग्स विल बी अंडर योर कंट्रोल आप धीरे धीरे साइकिलिंग कर सकते हैं तो बच्चे करते हैं ये कई तो बहुत बड़े बड़े टायर लेते हैं भी कोई सटनी रफ राइडर है कोई प्लेन राइडर है प्लेन रोड है सैंड रोड है तो साइकिल के लिए कोई भी रोड ठीक रहे आप 
ऑफिस में जाता है साइकिल लेके वर्क प्लेस में जाता है साइकिल लेके कहीं भी आप जा सकते हैं आपको खाली साइकिल इस रोड में ही जाना है तो साइकिल कहीं भी ले जा सकता है कोई भी साइकिल ले सके सकते हैं सो यू कैन चूज एनी टाइप ऑफ साइकिल एनी टाइप ऑफ रोड ओके गियर साइकिल और टेम्पल साइकिल है ना या या सो सो थैंक यू एनी मोर क्वेश्चन बिफोर वेट फॉर Brother Shama, I have a question. Brother Shama, yeah, yeah tell me. Do you have uh, encounter like city senior citizen bike lane? Do they have something like that so that they can uh, go cycle and enjoy themselves? Or what do you think? What what bike lane? What what you said? What what you said again? Bicycle lane for senior citizen. Ever encounter uh. this or not? No, I say for senior citizen it will be very much comfortable. If you are a fast rider, you have to practice yourself, and you to make a comfort so that you can enjoy together cycling. Okay. So, cycling, <laughs> cycling with a group will be better. Maybe four, five, every day if you, by going in, maybe in the early morning, uh, maybe in the evening. so according to your time you make a group and cycle particularly for the senior people it works maybe 20 minutes maybe 10 minutes 15 minutes according to your convenience thank you brother shamal any more question There is a Muhammad Zakaria raising hand. Do you have a question, Muhammad Zakaria? Please unmute yourself. Unmute yourself, please. Unmute yourself. Thank okay. you. Thank you so much. Thank ah, you so okay. Much. Hi, hi. Very nice. Good afternoon from Sayyid Muhammad Zakaria. Uh, sorry. Proceed, proceed, brother Zakaria. Uh, uh, I am from Pakistan Boy Scout Association. Uh, my question is that for the beginner, uh, it is impossible to handle a bicycle on a one hand. So how can we will cross a uh, road to give a signal uh, to the cars or motorcycle which are uh, from uh, coming to behind? Or uh, how can we take a U-turn at least? Okay. uh when you when you ride a cycle you take a cycle which can reach your feet by sitting at the cycle so while turn the back or turning on the right or left hand side you stop while you give your signal then you go around so it is better to stop a cycle in a safer place and give your signal then you gradually move thank you so much sir So it is. Yes. Thank you, Brother Shama. Actually, for kids, like what we have stated earlier in the opening or in the Facebook, mm -hmm. all the children set category. You need a chaperone. You need an adult to assist you to be present during yeah. your cycle, because it's very dangerous for children. Ah, uh, you need ah uh, an adult to be there. You know all the traffic and everything. Now cycle together. So please safety is number 1 no compromise 
it's our life and death. Yes. So please uh, comply accordingly, especially not only during our jamboree, but especially during cycling. So for our jamboree, we make it uh, mandatory and adult must be present. Okay, thank you. Yes. We must take care of safety first, yes. Yes, yes. Okay, with that last question, I think we will end our session. So next session, we will post inside the Telegram. For those who have not joined the Telegram yet, you can go to our Facebook page at Global uh, Scout Bicycle Club to uh, scan the Telegram and join uh, our next me? session. Okay, how, yes. do the telegram? how do we join the Telegram again? Uh, go to our Facebook page. The what, what do you your Facebook? Global Scout Bicycle Club. Go to Facebook. Search. Global Scout Bicycle Club, right? Yes, sir. Yes. Okay. You just scan okay. or you can click. So, Glo okay. Okay, sir. Global Scout Thank Bicycle you, Alo. All right. Club. Global Scout Bicycle Club, right? Yes, yes. Mm -mm. Yes. Thank you, sir. Okay, so... With that, thank you very much. So see you next one. And those who are cycling, please ride safely and safety first as uh, what you by Abdullah Sharma. Okay, I see you all next okay. one. Goodbye. Thank you, thank you very much. Yes, goodbye. Bye, sir. Thank you, everybody.